If celebrity gossip is what you crave, you've come to the right place because it's time to serve up today's buzz. I'm here to dish on all the hot Hollywood headlines. Who's entertainment senior weekly writer? <laughs> Tim Stack. We call him Stackable. We love you, yes. Stackable. Yes. Well, I love you stackable. too. I love you too. I love the curls. Hey, Real well, and the you. curls. Let's discuss the curls for a minute. Yes. Yeah. Aren't they hot? People. They are so hot. By they the way, are trending. You are, you are trending. And you are. You are. And can, you, can we let yeah. everybody know that on Thursday, we're actually going to let people know because we've had so many people writing in saying, what do you do? How do you get it? Laura's going to show people we how We shot it this morning, but yep. they're going to edit it, and then we're going to have a live yes. thing on. It's very important. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. Next time news. I come on, I'm going to have those curls. Oh. <laughs> right. I win. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, pink ha breaking news with Pink, huh? Yeah, Pink is pregnant with her second child. She uh, announced it on Instagram, as everyone does now. That's how yeah. you announce things. But she, uh, there she is with Carrie Hart, her husband, and her youngest daughter, Willow, who's five. But so she uh, posted this photo on Instagram uh, with Willow Pretty. sort of hugging beautiful. her. Yeah. yeah, it's beautiful. Her tummy. And she it, clearly, I mean, I don't know lady things, but I think she's far along. <laughs> um, yeah, you would be I'm correct. not familiar with that uh, part of the body, but uh, <laughs> I believe that's that's a far along pregnancy. But uh, yes, yeah, so this will be their second child. Um, and, you know, she's talked about, you know, she loves being a mother and, uh, you know, she's what a cool mom to have for Pink. But um, but she hasn't released an album in a long time. So that, I'm kind of I want her to get back into music. So she's probably loving be. being a mom. I yeah. know she's she's momming it up. Her priorities change. Exactly. Mm -hmm. yeah. So Rob Lowe hit Vegas with a whole big brood, right? Rob, yeah, Rob Lowe hit Vegas uh, with a surprise uh, guest. It's not what you think, though. It's uh, his son. Uh, it was his son, John's uh, 21st birthday. So he went with his wife, Cheryl, and uh, his other son. And uh, they he still looks like he's 21. I know, I know. Rob Lowe looks incredible. I know he's on a good aging plan. Uh, yeah. But so it was his 21st <laughs> birthday. They went to the Omnia nightclub and they had like table service and bottle service. Calvin Harris was the DJ that night, what? so they heard Calvin Harris. Yeah, Rob Lowe likes to party it up. He does. I guess so. I mean, they were. Yeah, I mean. Granted, I once, uh, my parents went, went went with me to see Boogie Nights on my 18th birthday, so, That's which is, disturbing. which is a film, yeah. Wow, we've met your little mother. I know, she I went know. to that? Yes, yes. At the end, there's like a big reveal. It's about the porn yeah. industry. Yes. And at the end, there's a big reveal of uh, body part, and my mom just like gasped laughing. Well, <laughs> anyway, everybody yeah, gasped. Sorry, I don't know. Anyway, it's just, just like, families are different. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I should have, maybe I should have revealed that. <laughs> so Demi Lovato has a very yes. cute other half, doesn't yes, she? Yes, Demi Lovato, uh, she broke up with Wilmer Valderrama, who was her long-term boyfriend this summer uh, after uh, like six years together. And uh, she kind of now has revealed that she's dating this UFC fighter named Luke Rockhold. What? Which, hello, hot name. And secondly, <laughs> hello, gentlemen. He is so hot. Um, but also, Rockhold, hot. Anyways, oh this gosh. is them. Look how handsome he is. <gasps> and she Really? Great too. She does. But they are at. Uh, they went to. There's a big UFC fight at Madison Square Garden over the weekend, and so they sort of made their debut there. Luke's a UFC fighter, and uh, and she I actually she likes finds happiness. Yeah, she's yeah, had totally. a rough time. And she's such yeah. a totally, sweet totally. kid. Yeah, she really is. is. She is. But um, also get it, uh, Lovato, Luke Rockhold. Uh, but it was a big. I mean, there were lots of stars there. Madonna was there. Like Hugh Jackman. You're I am jealous. jealous of. I was saying I followed Luke Rockhold on uh, Instagram prior to this, and so <laughs> I feel a little. I feel like he's mine. <laughs> She took him from me. <laughs> she <laughs> took him from me. So sad. It's a really like, uh, <laughs> so sad. Therapeutic se uh, segment for me. Real quick, a uh, box office. What yes. was number one? Uh, number one was Doctor Strange. Again, it held yeah. really, really well. It only dropped like 49%. Uh, and then Trolls was number two. Yeah. Um, it also held really well. And Arrival, Amy Adams' uh, new movie about uh, an alien arrival. Um, she's a linguist who speaks to them. Did actually very, very strong. Um, it seems like people really want escapism because yeah. everything really held up well. So I think okay. just in well, trying times, you want to. Hope wanna, people get know. a chance to see uh, Hacksaw Ridge while it's still out because that it's also really held very, very well. Yeah, I'm, I'm, mm -hmm. I'm so glad. It's such an unbelievable movie. Yeah, I heard it's really good. Yeah. Thank you, Tim Stackable. Yes, thank You're you welcome. Stackable. I'll, uh -huh. Yes, I'll come back and share more awkward family stories <laughs> next time. Good. Bring your mom wait. back on. So I, will, I will. I <laughs> will.